Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking Johnson before here, bring us more Battlefield Hardline on PS4. Hopefully, you guys have been enjoying the gameplays here. I've been bringing you for from uh, Battlefield Hardline because I've been having so much fun. It's awesome, and I I like the game. You know, I love it. Hopefully, you guys uh, buy the game too and consider you know playing it because it's pretty fun. For me, it's more fun than Call of Duty: Advanced Warfare. So, anyways, let's talk about the gameplay. Now, this gameplay. I was in the middle of everything. I was in the middle of people picking up the goddamn briefcase. People were stealing the money. And by the way, I'm I'm the police side. All right, I'm not the, I'm not the robbers. I'm in the police side defending the cash. And this is what happened. I was like in the middle of everything. Everything was chaos. It was everything was like explosions and it. It was just insane, you know. And somehow I managed to survive. And um, the first half of the video is gonna be with an assault rifle, and the second half is gonna be with a submachine gun. So um, that's how I managed to go 21 kills and two deaths. 21 kills and two deaths. Try surviving like that much uh, in the game, you won't be able to, because everybody's moving around. Everybody can see you on the map sometimes. I don't know how, even though you know you have some kind of a ghost mask on uh, with a sniper, you still get spotted on. So there's just no way to hide. So it's kind of hard and difficult to actually you know kind of sneak around this in this game, but somehow I managed to pull it off. So um, I'm not rusty, guys. I'm still have those, those Call of Duty skills going on, and I'm pretty much showing it here in my gameplay. So um, yeah, that moment when I got sneaked up on, uh, that was the moment I died, and I switched over to the submachine gun. As you can see, I have the silencer on, so they don't even know where I'm coming from. I'm just standing here reloading my weapon. Another guy shows up, and another one's climbing up the stairs, and he gets killed. Donnie, yay! I got my revenge. So, uh, anyways. This is the moment where I actually survive for the next two minutes. So keep an eye out on the gameplay, keep your eyes peeled, because this is the part where you're pretty much gonna get excited. So I get like back to back kills like crazy in this gameplay and I I, I liked how I can just share it with you guys and you know hopefully you guys leave a like on the video because this pretty much is you know kinda difficult to pull off since everybody can see on the map. As you can see I got a long distance shots with this gun. And by the way, most of the SMGs can shoot from long range. So, uh, yeah, I really like kind of a noobish guy. Don't worry, you can shoot like from whatever range most of the time. And right here, I actually ran out of ammo. So I switched over to a third weapon, and this is what I had to play in for the for the next one minute or two. So so this is just super interesting to see. Uh, hopefully you guys are liking the gameplay, because it's pretty much insane what I'm putting off here. I threw a grenade into that room. The guy's just hiding in there. He didn't even bother moving. Correct, Graham. Got killed by me. With a grenade, I never thought it was that was, uh, was going to happen. I thought I think he was going to leave the place, but he didn't. So and that's what sucks sometimes with that SUV. You can't shoot through the goddamn window compared to the other cars. So uh, there's actually two armored vehicles in the whole game in Hardline. Just in case you're wondering, because most of you guys are like upset about tanks. Um, there's two armored vehicles at least. The SUV, which has like a gun turret on top of it, so it's kind of like twisted metal uh, somehow. Sometimes it feels like that when I'm when I'm driving the SUV uh, armored SUV. Um, the other one is the headquarters vehicle. That one you can shoot from the sides and that's it. You can add more to it later on, but as far as we know, you can only shoot from the sides. Hopefully I get to upgrade it pretty soon. So um, anyways, that was a nice kill right there. I sneaked behind him. And by the way, that's a little glitch right there. When I dropped onto the floor, I was actually trying to climb over the fence, but it's a, it's a little glitch, slightly of a, not a big deal glitch, but you know, th that glitch is there. All right, hopefully they do fix it, but I'm, I'm pretty sure they're not. They're just going to add more DLC, more bullshit, like, oh, we're going to update this. They're not going to update it at all. I'm still going to drop down every time I try to climb, climb an edge. So um, the, that's the headquarters vehicle right there from the enemy side, and people keep on spotting on it. So I'm like, holy shit. So I got to keep my freaking vision open right here because these guys are going to start spawning in like crazy. And um, no, it's like a, it's kind of like a spawn beacon for from uh, Battlefield 4, but this time it's with a vehicle. Once uh, we destroy the vehicle, they won't be able to spawn there at all. So, and again, I got <laughs> shot from behind with another RO-933. That gun fucking sucks. It doesn't have any kind of damage. I don't know how people still running with that. Just buy another gun because that gun sucks. It doesn't have any damage. It doesn't have any range. It doesn't have any control. And people, you still use it. Uh, maybe because they're just level 5 or something. I'm pretty sure you can already buy a weapon by the level of, uh, like around level 7 or 6. You'll, you'll, you'll probably have like around uh, 30 Gs by that point. So that is it guys, that's the end of the gameplay. The gameplay's about to end right here. No more kills, maybe like one or more assists and that's it. But uh, nothing else to expect. So hopefully you guys like, uh, hopefully you guys like the gameplay. It was like a lot of kills back to back. I survived like for, the, for two minutes straight. I stole a gun from a dead body and that's how I managed to survive. So 
If you guys love the gameplay, make sure you leave a like on the video and also leave a comment. If you guys like some some part of the video, just let me, let me know in the comment section. I'll bring in more uh, more gameplays like this. And by the way, the best class setups are coming up, so make sure you subscribe for more because more tips and strategies are coming up for Battlefield Hardline. So, um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and subscribe for more Battlefield Hardline on PS4.